So you hear about a lot of offensive players being in a zone sometimes. And do you feel sometimes defensive players, can when you go out there, or do you sometimes can feel like you're in a zone a little bit? Yeah. Um, for nose guard, it may be. It may look a little different. Uh, today was a good day for me, obviously. But, um, no, nah, man, you definitely be in the zone. Um, like I said, it could be a lot less uh, – Eye popping or you know, uh -huh. uh, highlight worthy plays, but uh, definitely you definitely can. Mike, uh, I know you didn't have a sack until today, but mm -hmm. you know all the the metrics said that you're having just a great great season in terms of beating the guy. Maybe just some bad luck in terms of not finishing those plays off. I mean, how did you feel kind of coming in today, and what was the relief to actually get a sack and make it a strip sack? Big big relief. Um, you always want to do your part. Um, like I said, I've like you said, um, I've been getting to the quarterback, just hadn't getting them down. Um, I happened to get a, fi a fine for tackling them and not getting them down. So, um, no, nah, man, it's uh, it's been an interesting year, but our defense has been doing great. Uh, we, we let a lot of stuff slide today. But, um, no, nah, it's good to be on the board and uh, hopefully a lot more to come. Michael, how personal were you taking it when they were running the ball, just your defense as a whole, when they were running the ball a little bit on you guys early? Uh, very, very much so personally. Um, outside of uh, Colts. That was probably our, our worst performance. So um, anytime we pride ourselves, we haven't – I mean, we gave up a long run in Cleveland too. They pushed them like right over 100. But um, like I said, we pride ourselves on stopping the run. Uh, we got a lot of stuff to clean up in that area, especially the first half tape. So um, before Seattle comes, we got some, got some work to do. But uh, I'm glad we made some strides in the second half for sure. What kind of uh, – what does that do for your – Team in general, and you know the offense is maybe truck hits a little bit of a rut there, but yeah, your defense is you in particular and other guys making plays to kind of keep things going. That's a momentum jump, man. Um, you know, as a defender, you know, especially for me, I never see those kind of plays come my way, but. Uh, it's just a momentum jump for everybody. So two fourth down stops, no matter who makes them. Um, we've seen a lot of guys, Meta Beaks, been playing out of his mind. Rose had amazing games. Uh, when you have a lot of defenders who are really good, um, it's a long season. So you need guys like myself. Like Brody's going to have a big game, I'm sure. Herb's going to have a lot of different plays. So um, anytime any defender can lift up our team and uh, you know make some big time plays, especially consecutively, it's, uh, it's big, no matter who it is. But what's it like for, for an opposing defense or defenders to see a guy like Gus Edwards just kind of getting the ball time after time, especially late in that game? That's awesome, man. Uh, that's a momentum killer. So uh, especially when you can bleed the clock, bleed the clock excuse me, um, that's big time. So we love to see those drives go as long as they want to go. So, uh, no, nah, man, like I said, for us, getting those fourth down stops, just how we see our offense running the guys over and uh, having Gus run for three touchdowns and run for 80 yards is huge, man. So uh, that's the momentum. Momentum booster for sure. You guys have done some traveling. I mean, London to the desert. Mm -hmm. Now, though, at your final nine games, you play six of them at home. How big of, of a you know thing could that be for you guys? Grateful. Grateful for that. Um, just to be back on Eastern time zone would be great. So I woke up at 4 in the morning this morning. It was, it was rough, man. But, uh, yeah, we had a long way to go before the bus left. But, um, no, man, it's, it's good to be back on the Eastern time zone. Like I said, being at home, being comfortable, uh, just getting in that routine again. Um, I feel like we always play great or a lot better at home. So um, that's, a, that's a plus big time. Right, thanks, Mike. Thank, Thank you. Sure. Appreciate it.